You too can't kiss Well boo you who hiss Screw you don't give a piss I interrupt this broadcast I command your immediate attention A few heart stopping seconds To put you in the moment Brace yourselves Wait to hear what follows Those four chilling words Chills on the back of your neck I am a metaphorical figurehead of impoliteness, gatecrashing the spotlight. Have you ever heard of a polite and pre-announced heckle? A presence amongst an outraged public who give me my name, the heckler. I am heckler, super heckler, homo heckler, one in the eye for politeness, heckling, shortest, briefest, neatest, tidiest way of getting an idea across, and I heckle with finesse. You two can't kiss, well boo you, who hiss, screw you, don't give a piss, news flash, all systems dislocated, I am the stop, the pause, the break, within those smooth running operations of homophobia in your head, I will derail you, you see me as impoliteness, an unfortunate behavioural aberration, nasty scum on the margins, relegate me to the realm of vulgar and uncouth, but I am outspoken and courageous. Me being queer for you is a heckle, an interruption, a violation. I will keep on interrupting, interruptions, poetic, lyrical, unexpected, transformative. I have to do this, I have to interrupt the world, to save the world from you, like a bolt out of the blue, decapitating heteronormativity, disrupting your commitment to continuity, to sequence, to pattern, to order everything into a heteronormative box. Heroic public speech superhero, suspending rhetoric, preserving the right to speak out of turn. I preserve my right to live out of the confines of what you declare as normal. Inter rompere, inter between, rompere, break. We are hecklers, super hecklers, homo hecklers, flash mobbing, streaking, protest marching, habit, hoc habit, he's had it, mitter, send him back. We take our lead from the language of Roman gladiatorial games downturned thumbs we will break the between spaces from the start so your homophobia can't even make it past the finish line we are slapstickers we get knocked down but we survive we take great pleasure in seeing your prejudices come undone schadenfreude us queers have split second timing and wit volume and a sharp tongue on our side and most importantly the gift of humour our humour Homo humour can wreck anything. You think you can do a put down or wait until you hear ours. Puncture and prick. We gobby queer insurgents have a catalogue of weapons to defend, parry, attack and destroy. And what you gonna do, Mr. Heteronormative? Who's heckling who now? Approach one, abandon speaking, leave. Approach two, carry on, start again from scratch, appear emotionally unscathed, ignore. Approach three, battle of the put down, stand up to the heckler, demonstrate resilience, resilience. defeat the heckler, we'd like to see See you try. What's your comeback? What's behind your smile? What are you plotting? What's inside? Hidden inside your bag? A trumpet? A rat? A snake? Something to calm your nerves? Have you ever heard of a nervous heckler? This is political dissent from religious foundation and English dissenters. We join those speaking out against mainstream orthodoxies. Queer is a disruption. We are the disruption. Young queer people, we're space architects, imagineers, creating spaces that destroy our fears. We survive in spaces where we thrive and our beauty comes alive. Yet, 
these spaces we create, we animate by constant self-policing, say the right thing, body image, we're feeling quite oppressed ourselves. This community, our community, is not all rainbows, antagonisms and heckles from those within its colours, body shaming, identity naming, we will heckle you in just the same way. No one is superior just because you are one of us. No one gets off scot-free. We intervene in different ways in the constant stream around us. We open up spaces that disturb the course of everyday life. We aim to reframe the way in which you see and understand the world, changing the direction of the conversation, rerouting it into different territory, directing the flow of emotion, puncture emotion so it gushes out like a liquid through a burst pipe, tension relieved and exploded through laughter. Our laughter bears no stamp of sympathy or kindness, laughter not absolutely just nor kind-hearted either. You can beat us down but we are hecklers and slapstickers, glorious in getting up again and again.